What's up YouTube, it's Jackal Goldkick. So I'm gonna be making a video about why I regret the beef with Kadeem the King. And the reason I'm making this video is because doing reflecting, thinking about things. I kind of talked about this before in an old video where I was apologizing about the past, but this is how I really feel. I regret that whole beef with Kadeem the King. And I, I take responsibility for it because I started it. You know, it's not his fault. I started the whole beef. I know some people were entertained by it, but I regret the beef with Kadeem the King. And I'm going to talk about why that is. You know, coming up in the YouTube game, you know, especially by yourself, people like me and Kadeem, you know, it's very difficult to make it on YouTube. Even if you work your ass off, it is not easy to make it, you know. And it, it's just like, it's like, why, why did I ever beef with Kadeem the King? Why the hell did I ever do that shit? Because in reality, me and Kadeem the King, we're both from Michigan. We're from the same state. We're both from Michigan. We're both from the same state. We are, we're both passionate about YouTube and we want to, you know, be successful. And we're perfectionists too. There's a lot of similarities between us, you know. And instead of me beefing with him and all that bullshit happening from, you know, my, my fault, I should have been working with him. We should have been uplifting each other, supporting each other, instead of beefing with each other. Because like I said, we're both we're both YouTubers trying to make it on our own. We're both from the same state. There's some similarities. We're both from Michigan. And we should have both uplifted each other and helped each other out instead of the beefing thing, you know. And that, that's why I regret the beef with Kadeem the King, you know. There was nothing gained out of that. It really wasn't. It just caused problems, you know. And it just wasn't something, looking back, I regret it, you know, and I take responsibility for it. It was a stupid uh, beef on my part. You know, it's it was totally my fault because, you know, it, the whole the whole reason I beef with Kadeem the King was there was like this Ariana Grande controversy. Or, no, not, not controversy. There was something that happened with Ariana Grande concert. There was like a bombing. And Kadeem just made a joke about it. I went too crazy about it and called him out on YouTube over a joke. And I shouldn't have did that because freedom of speech and it's just comedy, you know, it's just comedy, you know, I shouldn't have started a beef over that or made a video about it. That was the wrong call. You know, I think maybe a partially the blame on that was at the time I was young and there was emotions, you know, there was emotions in play. I was young and they, maybe that's what transpired it, you know, and, and I admit it, I started the beef. It's my fault. You know, and it, it was stupid for us to beef on my part. It was stupid for what I did. You know, I should not have beefed with Kadeem the King over that problem. You know, there's there's legit reasons out there that you could be enemies with someone or beef with someone, you know. Um, but in terms of me and Kadeem the King, there was no legit reason for us to beef. And it was my fault. I take responsibility for it. I'm sorry for it. You know, you know, message to Kadeem the King. I'm sorry about the beef, man. I'm sorry about all that shit that happened, you know, and I'm sorry how it transpired, you know. Um, so, you know, Kadeem the King, man, I would like for us to go back to how we were, you know, cool with each other back in the day. Let's let's build a bond. Let's build being friends and let's, you know, become closer. Let's try to help each other in this YouTube game and try to help each other become successful and build each other up, you know, and try to make up for the past of us beefing. You know, that's what I want to do. You know, I mess with Kadeem the King. He's from the same state as me. You know, his dissing videos were funny. So shout out to Kadeem the King. I'll leave a link to his channel below. Um, yeah, that's all I wanted to say. I regret the beef with him. I apologize for it. I wiped my hands with it. You know, it should have never happened. It was it was my fault. And we should have helped each other out instead of beefing with each other. You know, that's something I regret. Being young, emotions in play, all that shit. You know, at the time, you know, looking back, I should have just been like, you know what? It's just a joke. You know, even like even if like even if it happened now, like let's say it happened again or let's say let's say it didn't happen and it happened nowadays with how older I am now and stuff. You know, even if maybe I didn't agree with the joke or, you know, if I felt a certain way, you know, if it happened again or, you know, whatever you get. What I mean, if I felt a certain way, I would go about it differently. I would just disagree with it or something like that. I wouldn't start a beef or talk shit about it or make a video. You know, and it was just fucked up to do that. I'm also sorry to uh, Bree and Dej. I know they mostly beef with me because of, you know, Kadeem the King and they're his family. But I want to apologize to Bree and Dej. And shout out to Bree and Dej. I'll link their channel below too. I'm sorry to Bree and Dej um, for the stupid ass beef and the back and forth. You know, Kadeem's a cool dude. I should have never beefed with him. So yeah, I also want to apologize to, you know, his family, uh, Bree and Dej. I'm sorry to you too. 
Um, never should have beef with Kadeem, never should have beef with you and started all that stupid shit. I just want to move on from it, learn from it, and try to grow stronger, basically. So shout out to Kadeem the King. Um, yeah, I hope he sees his video, reacts to it, or whatever he wants to do. Hope this message gets across. You know, that's, what, that's really all I want to say about it. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe, and share. And that's it. And like I said, Kadeem, I would like for us to, you know, grow as partners, as friends, and, you know, lift each other up and try to make it in this YouTube game. We're, we're from the same state, and that's what we should do instead of, you know, being being away from each other or, like, beefing, you know. I think, you know, like like how I'm close with Spirited 21 and I've worked with him. That's how I want. I want, I want me and Kadeem to be like you know, to be like Game and 50 Cent before they had a falling out. You know what I mean? To be like Dre and Eminem, you know, just some examples right there where we can help each other on YouTube, make it, make it this YouTube game. And we're, we're both from Michigan, the same state. You know what I mean? So that's all I got to say.